I uh, did the Robinsons thing uh, for Robinsons in Locos Norte. Uh, now I'm going to show you guys how to get to um, the Lawag Bridge. Uh, there's an entryway into the city, but it involves having a long bridge. I'll show you the river basically. And um, here I am, one to the street from my relative's house. The uh, sun is setting, I believe it's almost um, 6 or so, 6, 5.45 or 6. So. Yeah. Um, I'm here at the um, the barangay whatever. Uh, is that? I don't know what this is. It's like a... Where you pay everything taxes. So this is barangay 9 on that side. I am standing on Barangay 8. Barangay 8 is like basically little small districts um, or subdivisions of a district. A district somewhat involves like a whole town and, and some towns here are called um, cities. It all depends on what law they are following. Now I'm going to show you guys how to get to the Lawak Bridge. <clears throat> so as you can see, again, Data Center College of the Philippines. Uh, this is where you can learn the, those certain trades that you're looking for here in Lawak Center, uh, Lawak City. Um, Five story building. And on my. This is the um, bus station called Maria de Leon. There is at one church um, during Easter Sunday, this whole street, this whole long street right here, uh, they did that procession thing um, and basically wheeled all these floats pertaining to um, Jesus' whole um, life, basically. And so this is the bridge. Here is your Lawag Kalesa, um, basically. Lawag City, with the fountains and stuff.
McDonald's, number one in the world, but in the Philippines, it's Jollibee. Yeah. Uh, eventually, I'll, um, maybe I'll even spot a Jollibee sign as tall as that. Another tricycle mode of transportation. Your basic death trap where everybody would complain about you guys going on the stupid road. Yeah. Uh, your typical rubbish again. Um, being dumped by I don't know who, but it seems like that this one neighborhood dumpsters stuff right there which is kind of messed up um, yeah be beautiful sunset and on that side you have your Lawag sign for I guess the top uh, like a small hill maybe the tallest structure here uh, like the Hollywood sign, they have a Lawag sign. Um, that, yeah. Water hyacinth. There's a Partos bus that goes all the way to Manila. Those two buses, you can actually go all the way to Cubao in Manila. Uh, the only problem is it takes about 10 to 11 hours uh, with a, a lot of major stops along the way. So, yeah. It's the stops that kind of give you a lot of fatigue. Uh, but, you know, you gotta pee, right? Or you gotta use the toilet or grab something to eat. So that's why they stop.
So right there in the distance, you can actually see a Jollibee sign next to the entryway arc of Lawak City. It's going to be a beautiful sunset today. Very beautiful. Sun, my friends. Down there you have a fishing trap. Uh, the reason why they put the branches, um, it's a good hiding place for fish. Uh, what they do is they surround it by it with a like a seam net or a lay net. And after doing so, they take out the branches and basically uh, pull in the net. And whenever they catch from that um, that nest looking thing, uh, so they pretty much take home. Here you have your trees, the Kamachili trees. Um, there is also uh, monkey paw trees. And I believe I see a mesquite tree as well over there. So they have a few varieties. You might see some in Hawaii. Um, some might not even be seen in Hawaii, but for me being in Hawaii, I recognize this tree, monkey paw tree, Kamachili tree, monkey bar tree, and one down there looking like a kiave or mesquite. So the sun's still going down more. Uh, hopefully I'll reach that sign right there soon and cut off the video. If you notice, there's a lot of modes of transportation here in Lawak City, from buses, commuter jeeps, kalesas, vans, cars, trucks, uh, tricycles, 
actual tricycles for even the bicycle. So that's pretty cool. It's actually a half Filipino girl <laughs> controlling the Kalesa. Yeah. Uh, here it looks like some sort of ramp area for the BMX. BMX or motocross or something. Uh, looks like it. I don't think it's an ATV thing. Yeah, it looks like a BMX track because I, I can see all the jumps and everything like that. So not bad. At least they're trying to start something in places that's not being used. Army. Oh, somebody had an accident before. <laughs> Here's another one as well. So this is the Arcway, the famous Lawag Arcway. Um, when arriving here, if you catch um, Partus, RCJ Lines, Maria de Leon, Farinas Lines, Florida Lines, and I believe there's one more. But yeah, Partus, Farinas, Maria de Leon, Florida are the major um, companies as well as Farinas. To bring you to Lawang City. You can find them all in Kubal or um, UST which is... I forgot. All I know is UST is one of the stops or the major hubs for uh, Mario De Leon and um, Farinias Line. So. so here's the sign. So. Interesting. And your basically large Jollibee sign over there. So, seems like uh, 